The acoustic tour is going to be classics, Schenkerbahn classics, and uh, some UFO in it, and uh, from the new acoustic uh, Schenkerbahn acoustic project uh, songs. Mm -hmm. Have you planned to uh, do a DVD as well? I mean, this tour after this no, tour. yeah, DVD we're planning to do in January for the 30th anniversary of MSG. Mm -hmm. Clinics. I, I don't really do clinics. I, I prefer to play, you know, rock music with a band. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, you know, every solo I play is special for me because I go very deep and I create, um, you know, it's usually a happy place when I play solo, so it's difficult mm -hmm. for me to tell. Do you follow any modern guitarists and how, how, how much music do you listen to? Cover? The last one was Leslie West, uh, probably when I was 17 years old. Mm -hmm. And then I decided to go my own way and create instead of consuming. So I have fun uh, creating music and then um, I leave it to the consumer to listen. And uh, But I don't, uh, I try to stay away from music as much as possible in mm -hmm. order to stay fresh okay and you don't li you don't listen to any instrumental guitar music right no because i need to stay away from music because i'm creating music so i want to have a clean head mm -hmm. so you probably uh, have any plans concerning your collaboration um, with it with the, this lineup i mean after this acoustic rock tour any plans to do uh, with the uh, bar another Album. Yeah, absolutely. But I think we, we have to figure out because we're doing a DVD and a live album mm -hmm. and uh, maybe then after that we do another electric album. Mm -hmm. How do we feel now working with uh, Burden? Okay, great. The same chemistry, everything is absolutely, great. Absolutely, yeah, yeah. And you, you again, you uh, write songs together yes. and mm -hmm. you, you probably have a lot of songs for the next album. No, I just, what I do is when I practice, I bump into riffs and whatever I like, I just record little pieces and I collect these pieces. And when it's mm -hmm. time to make an album, I listen to those pieces and then I go from there. Mm -hmm. Have you got any plan of um, collaboration with uh, your brother, Rudolf? Yeah, we're thinking of doing something Schenker Brothers, but you know, we have to play by ear. He's doing with the scorpions, I do my things, and you know, we have to find the time to make it. Oh, yeah. They're gonna do a next big tour next year, yes. So it's hard to do. How do we feel uh, comfortable enough or something like uh, with the Dean guitars? And why did, why did you change your endorsement company in, in, in a couple of words? Because I was approached by Dean. I usually don't go around and check guitars. Um, I had a guitar that worked, you know, and so I didn't have to look, but mm -hmm. Dean was coming to me in Chicago and asked me to play it uh, and try it out, and I went, oh, I was amazed, I said, this is really good, and uh, we talked and I, we decided to work together. And all your DNV guitars are available at the moment in stores, yes? I think so, I'm mm -hmm. not really sure how that works, but uh, I think my guitars are in stores, yeah. Hi, this is Michael Schenker. You're watching One Rock. Keep on rocking. Mm -hmm.